apologise to Charlotte Bellis. Uh, look, I don't want to make any comment on that while there is a potential, while she's considering her potential legal options, that's her right uh, to be able to do that. What, what I would say is that this case was brought to my attention just only a couple of days ago by uh, another Member of Parliament. Uh, I contacted MIQ to make sure that her case was being appropriately handled. Uh, in fact, well, th through my office I contacted MIQ to make sure that her case was being appropriately handled uh, and was given some reassurance that actually they had already been reviewing that and looking at how they could better uh, deal with that, uh, recognising the extraordinary circumstances that she faced. Her lawyer says that you breached her privacy and were trying to smear her with the statement that you released. Were you trying to smear her? Uh, no, absolutely not. But I, I'm not going to comment on it because obviously while she's considering legal action that would be inappropriate. There's no question that in amongst the 200,000 people who have been able to enter through our managed isolation system, that there have been, within that, people with some really, really terrible and difficult stories and situations. And there will be numbers that aren't included in that list that will equally have really distressing situations. On the flip side, that system has also saved thousands of lives. So there have been no easy answers through this period, and I think we've all known that there have been very tough calls. I think going forward, though, we can all see that within sight is a change in system entirely, where we start removing that bottleneck whilst trying to continue with a strategy on COVID that keeps people safe. And we'll have more to say on how we'll be changing up that system on Thursday. We do have an emergency allocation system that can issue people a spot within 14 days. And that has been used in some, in some really difficult situations. But actually, what is going to make the biggest difference here is us not having to rely on MIQ in the same way. And in just a couple of days, we'll be announcing how we will be changing up our system. As COVID changes, we are, and in a way that continues to look after our whole population.